that's a difficult decision to make to move mm-hmm. on. But you have to understand the teams are going to have to change. Like that's just how it's going to have to go. Defensive side is going to look different. Offense side is mm-hmm. going to look different. But if you pay 17, which they did, and you have faith in 17, you just got to assume that the next team is going to be just as good, hopefully better than the previous one. Well, and you mentioned it yesterday, talking about Brady and Manning and Rodgers and guys like that. Like those types of quarterbacks create stars. You know, like you can go out and pay a guy top dollar if he's already established as one of the best guys in in the league. But the way they've paid Josh Allen and we've watched him, how good he is, they obviously believe he's one of those guys where if they draft a couple receivers this year and they sign Curtis Samuel, I think too, like mm-hmm. yep. they believe that he can he can create a star. Like they don't need to be paying a guy top dollar in order for them to get production at receiver. Well, so to that point, Tom Brady, uh, there's actually a video released from the golf <laughs> tournament in which they played. Aaron still has his very long hair. And <laughs> awesome. Looks like incredible hippie where Tom Brady talks about quarterbacks losing wide receivers and even predicts what's happening right now in Buffalo. Devontae left him and Tyreek left you, Patrick. Josh, don't worry, someone's going to leave you too. I love you. My boy Mike never left me, I'll tell you. Devontae yeah, they're talking left. about losing yeah. your weapon mm-hmm. and he said, Josh, don't worry, someone's going to leave you. Stephon Diggs now gone. He did. These are decisions that get made business-wise. Tyreek, remember, mm-hmm. trade, uh, pay by yep. Miami Dolphins because yep. of money. So if you're a great quarterback, there's a good chance you're going to mm-hmm have a great wide receiver, and with the new market of what wide receivers are and can get, especially if they're great, it's going to be hard to keep tag team partners together. Now, Chase and Joe Burrow seemingly going to be able to remain together going forward. T. Higgins, though, probably not going to be able to happen. And Jamar Chase, probably this next contract, they're going to pay the quarterback probably. So he's probably going to have to go elsewhere. This is going to become a trend, I think, which is not cool. I don't love it. But I think this is going to become a common trend as the business continues to go where it's headed for these wide receivers. Well, and think about the team that keeps beating them in the playoffs, the Kansas City Chiefs. Like, I now, do does everyone think Josh Allen is as good as Mahomes? Probably not. But I think the Bills think Josh Allen is as good as Mahomes. They paid him like he is. And they saw what Mahomes has done with these wide receivers since Tyreek has left, and and they're probably thinking in their head, why can't we do the same with Josh? Is is probably what they're thinking. Yeah, and Dalton Kincaid, maybe he gets going. A little exactly, bit. like yeah. he, he could be their guy, and who like they might start leaning on James Cook because they get, Shakir was a dog. Co- yeah. yeah, Shakir was they a ran dog a too. Ton but after yeah, once they fired mm-hmm. uh, Dorsey, yeah. they started really running the ball, and that's oh yeah, kinda, let James. James. Cook. Cook, and that's kind of what you know. Not the Chiefs completely lean on Pacheco like that, but they use mm-hmm. Pache- they give Pacheco twenty carries pretty consistently. Like if they start doing that with James Cook, they might not need that top end guy. 